Hi guys, haven't done one of these for a little while. Wooden construction kit. Cost me 50p in a charity shop. For those of you who don't know what 50p is, that's half of a pound, a GB pound, UK currency. So, what's that? About 60 cents or something? I don't know. When I say 60 cents, that'll be the American dollar. All you've got to do is Google it if you want to know the comparison prices. Just type it in. Although they call them GBP, Great British Pound, and USD for US dollar. Right, so the usual thing, although we haven't done one for a little while, you find part slot one and put part one into it. That's one to seven there, so that piece goes through there, and pieces one to seven go on it. So that's one, and there's seven. Mm. Throat's going funny. Right, see if I can talk normally now. Okay, so identify which panel is which. That's that one. That's that one. So that must be that one. So, like we said, part one, if you're really keen, you take all the pieces out, sandpaper them so they're all nice and smooth, and paint them if you want to paint it. So, one, seven, or one to seven, go on this one. The question is always which way round is up and which way is down. Depends whether that's the, yeah, that's going to be the head end and that's the tail end. And then you have to try and work out, that looks to me like it actually goes that way up. Because that slopey bit there, we can see there. So that was one. Two is there. Again, have a quick look at the end there, try and work out which way round that is likely to go. Nope, really can't figure that out. Oh, well that slot has got to line up with that slot. Has it? It's not going to like that. That's not good. Stuck already. Oh well, let's go a bit further. It might make sense once we get going. But we might well have to turn that one the other way up. Oh, hang on. That's the head, isn't it? Yeah, that's the head. So I got that wrong when I said it was going to go in that end. It's going to go in that end. That makes more sense. Yeah, now we're cooking. Okay, so that's one, two. Three. Four. 
four. If you buy one of these and it's a proper woodcraft kit, as in woodcraft construction kit, if you go to their website they do actually have um, how to build videos. So you don't have to try and follow what I'm doing. Or if you can't quite work out what I'm waffling on about. Uh, where are we up to? That was four. No, that was five. Did five? Six. Okay, six. And then seven is the other bit of body. Didn't look what time it was when we started. Uh, what's the camera say? Oh, camera says four minutes, 59 seconds so far. And that bit just wants to be that little bit awkward. A little bit tight. Are you pain? it down. Right, we're on there now. So that's up to seven. Eight is going to go through the middle there. So where's eight? Over there. That piece. No, that's not going to go through that way. It's going to have to go Inside. Come on, that's a bit of a cheat. Can't get that in there. Oh, that one's in place. Check the picture again. Which way up does it go? That's going to be pointing down like that. That one's in. And I bet we got to do the one at the far end as well. That's number 38. How are we going to get that in there? Ah, I see it doesn't go right the way through. That's all right then. So, that one's going to go through there. That one's got to go. Right the way through. It's been awkward again. Come on. There we go. Took a bit of wiggling. It's in there now. And that one's got to line up. Right. Got there in the end. It's better that they're tight because then they'll hold together without putting glue on them. Even though I always seem to end up putting glue on them. So that was eight and nine. Ten. Yep, that's going to go in there. Eleven. Twelve. 
13. They do have to go in the right order because they're slightly different sizes. To give it a bit of curve on its back. 14. So he's got a little bit of a curve on his back. And if you're really keen, you could sand it to make it nice and smooth. Right, that's 14. Where's 15? Fifteen. Fifteen is that piece. And that is going to be on there. Just see if we can see which way up. I reckon probably that side. Yeah. Fifteen. Hang on, I've moved my bits out of order, haven't I? There we are. 16 down there. You can go through and write the numbers on them first. And then if you get them out of order, you can still find them again. That one doesn't want to come out. Come on. If we just break it like that, then it'll come out. Yeah, there we go. So that's going to go up there. Is it? Or is it? No, it isn't. It's going to go. Really? I would have thought there'd be another gap, another one between there. That seems very loose. 16. Oh, I can't understand that being that much of a gap. Yeah. That seems odd. 17. That one. Be on the other side, like that. And then eighteen. On eighteen, there that piece. Yeah, that's not good. Can't be right. There's far too much space there. I suppose I could squeeze them apart, squeeze them apart, stretch them apart a bit. Makes them a bit tighter. Uh, 17, 18. I saw 19 just now. Where did I see 19? Nineteen is there, and that's the tail. Or at least the slot for the tail. Yeah, that pulls them all back in tight again and these ones drop off. I'm going to have to glue them. 
I really don't want to. But they're just dropping off. super glue just to stop them dropping off. In a minute we'll find out why they're dropping off. There's probably something else that should have been there, but that'll do for now. I think I'll give that a little drop as well. The top broke off my super glue little tube. That's why it's running out there so easily. Right, how are we doing? That was 19, 20. 20, 20, 20 is across the top of his head. Which is going to be this piece. That's going to be that way up. Twenty one, twenty two. Twenty one. Come on, it's got to fit up there. Twenty one. Twenty three. Twenty two. Twenty two is the year. Right. Which way does his ears go? No, it's not his ear, it's his cheek. Like that. That's better, that's a better fit now. And that one. That one is on the cheek. Yeah, that fits better. So that's 23, 24, 25. Can you see it? 25 there. It's going to be the front leg, I think. Seven twenty-five. Now, which one are we looking at? That one. Twenty six. It's that one that almost came out with it. Again, that's a bit loose.
being a bit more generous with that glue than I would be normally because it's just leaking out. Yeah, you started off tight, some of them, but now they're quite loose. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine back legs. What are we missing? This piece. That end goes up there. That goes on there. In that piece. Oh, I was hoping we get this done in one shot, but I'm gonna have to start the camera again in a minute. It's just gonna fill up the memory. Thirty-one. Where are you? Thirty-one up there. That's gonna be up there. And again, they're all a bit loose. So we'll give them some glue. Okay, I'll inspect the other sides next. That was up to 33. 34, 35, 36. That one. That goes on the inside. that one back out again though because I'm going to do the same as I did with the other one. So that's the in. That leg.
Right, so how are we doing? That was up to 36. In fact, it was up to 38. Thirty-nine is definitely an ear, and forty is an ear. Right, that lot's clear. Put that to one side. That's an ear. That will be thirty-nine. Which way does his ears point? Sort of forwards. fell off. I knew it was going to fall off, that's why I was trying to glue it. I'm going to use some thicker glue really. So that one's empty. We'll put that to one side. What have we got left? Feet and tails and eyes. I'm not going to worry about the eyes. I think they're not very good. Ah, does his toes point in or out? That's going to be the one on this side. That's going to be one on the other side. It keeps falling off. Yeah, I'm going to have to put some thicker glue on there. And then this is the tail. Finish with that. That's going to be the middle one. That's going to need glue as well, isn't it? It's much too loose. But it is finished. I'll put a little bit of glue on it and then we'll do a final view. Let's see if I can use this 3D pearl effect stuff. Craft. It's not glue, it's sort of paint. It's quite thick, although this has been in the sun all day, so it's a bit, a bit runnier than normal. Do for the eyes. There we go. Rabbit in the garden. That'll do. Thanks for watching. You'll find more information down in the video description. You might like to watch that video up there. And you might like to subscribe over there.